Good morning. It's 7.44 in the morning and we are getting ready to go on our last trip of the holiday season. We're headed to Colorado. Uh, you can tell by my very, very dark circles. I am so exhausted from Christmas and everything like that. This was the one and only trip we had actually planned for the holidays. As you guys know, the cruise was rescheduled. Got home, rested a little bit, dance recitals, Christmas, now this trip. So the past two days I've been spending resting because I've been really sick from just everything because we've not really had more than one day at home um, or at least one day to rest I should say other than like packing and doing laundry and stuff like that. So it should be a fun trip though. We're excited and um, we're going like we did last year, but we're going to a new place this time. They're gonna go skiing and snowboarding. I am going to rest before I start work up again. And my friend Mary, I'm gonna get to see her because she lives in Colorado, so that'll be fun. our hotel room and um, I am so tired nobody else is here <laughs> because I uh, I decided to stay while they get dinner and then they're just gonna bring me back some like steak or a salad or something like that filled my water I need to drink most of it and then I'm gonna put my herbs in it to take those yeah, so I'm just very tired. So tomorrow my brother-in-law is getting in and then we'll be heading to our actual location. Last year we went to Steamboat. This year we're going to... I always forget it. I'll have to tell you guys later because <laughs> I really can't remember. It's like on the tip of my brain. Like I, it's there but not. So tired. Um, I'm not going to be vlogging the rest of the evening because I'm just going to go to bed. Um, hopefully early. our Airbnb it's very nice but lots of stairs so I'm already like out of breath but they're very nice and gave us the like master room because I would be in bed more than anyone else during this trip so I can have some light and then I can have a nice bathtub to take a bath in and there's also a nice shower too Right up here was really pretty. Mary's gonna be coming for a couple days. Wow, look at this. So nice. And then I'll give you guys a little tour too. Yeah, I like that there's a chair. Since I'll be needing more quiet like in the evenings and stuff like that, this has a little bit more space and it's really nice to have the sunlight. So I think I'm gonna actually go ahead and unpack. Okay, I'm getting really worn out. I've almost got done pack, unpacking everything. Um, in the bathroom here, here with like snacks for my bath time or if I'm just laying down here and need a snack. And more snacks, toothpaste, you know, all that kind of stuff. Put some essential oils out. Got my stuff together for my bath. And then I went ahead and put like my extra winter stuff in here 
sweaters and clothes, some other things right here. We're gonna take my meds upstairs, but I wanted to go ahead and start this because it gets really dry in Colorado, so I made sure to bring a um, thing that would help with that. So I'm gonna do that. And then I have my meds and a sparkling water by my bed with more granola and then pain pills. Excited, babe? Yeah, I'm a little nervous. Really? That makes sense, I would be too. But as you guys know from last year, if you've been watching my vlogs that long, they, woo, right. They all go skiing and snowboarding and I stay here. But one fun thing this time, my friend Mary's coming to stay a couple days. And that would be a lot of fun. They just went to go to get lunch and groceries. I'm obviously far too exhausted to join them so I'm gonna be resting here yesterday I tried to vlog um, I was hurting but I just couldn't lift my head everything gets numb and big and swollen okay steps <laughs> I went down for one more thing but thankfully I don't think I'll need to go back down um, I had I'm having them get me like some water jugs this has my meds in it so i haven't been wanting to drink it because it's my first day back on some herbs that like in my ro rotating schedule and they are hitting me hard when i'm so exhausted I'm looking forward to some time for myself because i just get so tired i just feel like i could cry you know it's just part of it your body's so overdone so um this morning i rested all morning So I had a sparkling water on the plane I didn't drink, so I just brought it with me. So I'm just gonna get on this couch, snuggle up, snuggle up in a blanket and lay down. At least um, over the next couple of days, hopefully I'll be able to um, relax. The biggest thing is, even for me, like for someone watching this, they'll be like, oh, that's just not doing much. You should be completely relaxed. But that's not how it works with Lyme. Um, you're exhausted 24-7 no matter what you do. So laying down 24-7 helps. All right, I'm not gonna be able to talk anymore. But um, I don't know if they're going out to lunch and then going out again tonight. Um, if they go out tonight, maybe I'll go. Kind of just depends on if Mary's here. And Okay, they're still gone and gonna buy coffee. I am so exhausted. And how cute is this? They have some like coffee and half and halves in there. So I figured I'll just do a little bit and they have a bunch of these. So I figured I might as well because I'm on vacation. It's a little caffeine. I looked, I didn't see any decaf. But if my heart start racing, starts racing too much, I'll stop. Okay, well that was <laughs> much harder than it needed to be, but I'm getting it made. I'm gonna go back on the couch until it's finished. Nope, I'm not gonna drink them. Clumpy. I don't really drink black coffee, but at least there's some made, I guess. <laughs> I'll just like sip on it while I'm out there laying down. <laughs> okay, so they came back with gross.